What's up, everybody? It's an art man back with another video. I'm going to talk about how to draw smoothly and confidently. Now, there's two tips, in my opinion, on how to draw smoothly and confidently. The first tip is drawing in pen. Now, drawing in pen may seem pretty simple. Um, it may seem kind of kind of quirky. <laughs> But drawing in pen forces you to lesser your mistakes. It forces you to um, think more carefully and smoothly. And also it helps build muscle memory. First tip, well, right, first, tip, first benefit. Lesser your mistakes, the reason why it does that. Because let's say you're drawing in pen, right? And your brain is saying, hmm, I cannot make a mistake. I have ink. I'm drawing with ink. I'm not drawing with pencil. I'm not drawing with graphite. I don't have an eraser to erase this mistake. If I make a mistake, well, I have to go with the flow. I just have to deal with it and just continue my drawing. If you're drawing in pen, you really can't erase the ink. It doesn't necessarily have to be pen. It could be an ink brush. It could be an airbrush that has ink in it and you know you cannot erase the ink simple as that this forces you to think more carefully and smoothly that's the next benefit so you have to think think very cautiously in what you're doing at the same time you be less hesitant in what you're doing and you know you, you just just go with it you just go with it that happens because of practice you know if you keep on practicing drawing a pen your, well, your brain is a muscle, and what happens is, you keep on using the muscle over and over. It's gonna get used to the same feeling. You know, that's that's basically what muscle memory is. It gets, it's gonna get used to the same feeling every time you, you use the muscle. And in this case, your brain, when you when your brain is is teaching your your hands and your eyes to, you know sketch a face or or whatever you're making whatever you're drawing on paper you're doing it over and over and over with pen keep in mind the pen is the thing that lesser your mistakes you're going to be more confident in drawing you're going to be more confident in your work now i'm right here i'm just drawing a female character you guys only one but um in, in the future videos i'm gonna draw you know more characters like a completion of video me drawing um, several characters yeah that's that's pretty much it man for the little number one tip of course and the second tip is practice practice drawing no, it doesn't have to be every single day you don't have to you don't have to force yourself to draw don't force yourself to draw don't stress yourself out okay just take your time just be chill <laughs> You pour in some music, whatever, that makes you comfortable. And just draw. Don't force yourself. Okay? If you feel like drawing, just draw. It doesn't necessarily have to be drawing. It could be sports. It could be school. It could be um, anything. You know, it could be anything. Practice makes perfect. And that's like an obvious one. Practice makes perfect. A lot of people have been saying that, you know. But it's actually true. If you want to get something to your liking, you have a difficult time doing it. There's practice. Tell you what you go. You know? And those are like the only two tips I have that I do to improve my confidence in drawing and you know how to sketch very smoothly with barely mistakes. Now I'm not saying you don't have you must not draw in pencil, of course. Draw in pencil, do whatever you want. What I'm saying is, drawing in pen helps you. Uh, it forces you to improve. Yeah, it, it's gonna force you to improve. That's pretty much it for how to draw, you know, confidently. That's the only two tips I have for you guys. Please subscribe to my channel. This is my third video on this channel. And I'm still hanging on. Yeah. Peace.